Okay, sorry, so I'm just getting used to doing this and I'm just using my Android phone. I didn't realize that there was a maximum recording time, so I'll have to figure this out. I know other people have GoPros and different things and they can make like really long videos. Um, but the main thing I wanted to say today is that when you work full time, you kind of have to decide what gets done when. And this has been the hardest thing for me. Um, because I am doing eBay first, I'm putting it first because it's much cheaper to buy eBay stuff and resell it than Amazon as a rule. If I lived in a bigger city and I could go store to store, and when I do that, then I, the ratio is about the same. I can go to Walmart and find something for $3 that I resell for 20 That does happen also. But because of where I live and the amount of driving I'd have to do to get to where there's tons of Walmarts, Targets, arbitrage opportunities. Um, I can only do that once every week or two. And so the rest of the time, clothing is abundant, even in this small town, even an hour and a half away where I work. There's tons of great clothing. So that's why I've just chosen that niche. Um, I don't have to think about it. And um, so for today, like I said, I have an Amazon shipment. It needs to go out. I don't go to work till noon tomorrow on Tuesday. So that means I have to leave here uh, where I live in Wyoming. I have to leave here at least by 10, um, and that's if I have my lunch packed, ready to just hit the ground running when I get to work, um, because there is some construction between here and where I live now on the interstate, and so it's it's taking me, you know, the full hour and 15, hour and 20 minutes to get there. Um, in the winter, I wouldn't even leave by 10. I would leave at like 9 and then just hang out, go do some errands, go to the Goodwill if I get there earlier because the, the roads around here in Wyoming in the winter, I just can't even explain to you. Um, the roads are closed all the time. Uh, there are truck drivers from other states who just do not realize how icy it is, and so they don't, they don't slow down, and so they'll just veer right off and fall over. Um, I've seen it actually happen in front of me quite a few times because I've always commuted to either run the business or to go work as a nurse. And it's not a violent thing like you'd think, like they don't just wreck and it's not this major rough wreck. It's like just this kind of flipping over, they just slide off the road and... and um, so anyway, uh, that's my thing. I'm hoping by tomorrow at noon I'll report back to you right before I go into work tomorrow what I did actually get done. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to say I got my Amazon shipment out and all this eBay stuff here. I'm still about five totes behind my photographer. I have three up here um, that look pretty easy because it's like a big box of boots and some bigger things so it's not as much as it looks like but the other two or three tubs downstairs they are packed with clothing like layered packed so it's going to be a lot of listing so I think those are going to have to wait till next Monday um until I have more time off again. I could take them to my apartment in Laramie and make myself do, do them during the week but I feel like I don't want to do that I want to